for Mike Thomas and all the sponsors and all the gang at KPHX, happy birthday. And I'd like to say special thanks and ask you to give a special thanks to uh, my business manager, Paul Woodall, and my producer, you're here on the air with us, Peter Ockburn's around in the crowd somewhere. These are exciting times, folks, and anybody who tells you something through this microphone, please yeah. better forgive me. Yeah. All right. Anybody who tells you, thank you, Kim, thank you. Anybody who tells you elections don't make a difference, they don't know what they're talking about. Listen, this is a new day in Washington, D.C. And now, you know, if Alberto Gonzalez tries to fire eight U.S. attorneys for pure political reasons, Dan Leahy, or, I'm sorry, Pat Leahy, is on his case. Yeah. That's a big yeah. 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 It's Carl Rove. Carl Rove tries to... Uh, oh. secret RNC system and think he can erase the emails, Henry Waxman is on his case. And if George Bush tries to escalate the war in Iraq, well Harry Reid and Nancy Pelosi are on his ass. But only, 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 only if you commit to bringing our troops home as soon as possible. So, it's a great, it's a great new day in Washington, D.C. And I just want to say, this would not have happened without Progressive Radio. Would not have happened without Progressive Radio. So, on behalf of Stephanie and Tom and Mike and all the other people at Air America and Ed Schultz and everybody else, I just got to say, thank you. Because you and your support, you make it possible for us to tell the truth every day. And that's what it's all about. So, we're going to keep going with your help. In the 2008, we will have a veto-proof house. We'll have a veto-proof United States Senate. And we'll have a president that we can be proud of again. Thank you.